So today I'm going to ask you some questions. Do you remember the interview question that Greenwich asked you? Any of it, like anything? Do you remember? Yeah. So they asked me. Hey guys, and this is Anushka again. I hope you all are doing good and thank you so much for making it to 2000. If you're watching me for the first time, today I'm going to make video on this. I've been waiting to make this video since a very long time and this one's very special because this is not only me. There were so many people in this video who actually helped me film this and also they participated so it's a very big thing for me and in this video I'm gonna cover the interview questions. So many of you asked me what kind of questions Greenwich might ask so that's why I tried to gather all the questions directly from the students. I know you have heard this line a lot of times from a lot of you us, but this is something which means a lot to us after watching this video subscribe or like or comment or share it doesn't matter just any kind of engagement that really motivates me so please try to do any of it or all of it i'll be very happy and i hope this video can help you a lot thank you hi how are you doing i'm okay, okay. how are you i'm good um so today i'm gonna ask you some questions like do you remember the interview question that greenwich asked you any of it like anything so they asked me what reading I did to get into my course. They asked me, do you know about my, if I know about my course? Can I ask me why I wanted to go to uni in London? They asked me why did I choose this course? So why did I choose this university over other universities? Okay. Um, what are the subjects and why I chose this university? I think one of them was why did I want to study at this university in particular? If I know anything about Greenwich? Mm -hmm. Where I'm going to stay, how I'm going to plan my finances. Um, my university asked me like, why did I choose this university? Um, so the few questions they asked me is, um, aside from my general question like my name, they did ask um, why UK and why the the choice of interest, like why I studied the particular course I wanted to study. Brought up in the interview uh, about how um, important it is to have a um a broad knowledge of the course itself so i'll ask a couple of questions uh, regarding the course where i stay why i chose greenwich mm -hmm. uh, that's all i can remember currently uh, i was asked the names of my modules okay mm. also uh, i was asked what other offers i was holding at that current moment i was holding kingston east london a couple of other colleges uh, we are engineers actually, um, automobile is mechanical, so we were asked why did we shift from the technical field to the business, what brought us from technical to business fields. I forgot this question, why did I choose Greenwich or other universities? So I'm going to ask you the answers now, like what did you say, like how did you impress them? Actually I practiced about these questions for uh -huh. more than two weeks, <laughs> I wrote them down. <laughs> I research everything about the university from the government website all the resources available on the internet yes the research is very important because they ask very detailed questions mm -hmm. uh, especially about our course because mm -hmm. we need to be clear about what we are going to study and why we are going to study that okay do you want to say something to the students who are going to come to UK that how they should prepare their answers to read as much as possible and before the interview as well and obviously in the person's personal statement to show that you're aware of those core texts and a lot of wide reading as well mm -hmm. um, so you're really well prepared for any questions that they might ask you and especially if it's um, off topic or um, slightly off the subject of um, your course but it shows that you have a, um, a broad knowledge of things beyond your course. You can then anticipate um, what they might ask you and also your um, ahead in your course once you start your course you'll be um, very wide um, you'll be not wide <laughs> you'll be well read and mm -hmm. then your knowledge will be will extend so um, you're able to hit the ground running into your course so the more reading that you can do the better mm -hmm. and what was your answer um, I think I chose this university because it offered the course that I needed um, and it was close to me so those were the reasons why. Okay so that was your answer. Yeah. Thank you so much no for worries. sharing with us. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye. I studied landscape architecture so my course is really good in this university so I researched so why I chose this university okay. so yeah because it was a good course. All right and what was your answer? 
Okay, so um, I came to the UK. I personally wanted to come to the UK to study because of the diversity. Um, it's quite multicultural, and for me, I have a lot of um, family here, mm -hmm. as well as the place for me to meet new people, and it's also a place for me to grow in my knowledge as regards the course that I'm studying in. Um, I'm quite limited in my country, and there is no opportunity to explore that course well in my country. So. That's why I came to the UK to, to explore myself. So I'm a midwifery student. So I looked into certain conditions and how they affect pregnant women. Um, I learned all about that one certain article so that I could talk about it in my interview. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm a primary education student. They kind of asked me why I wanted to go to uni in London. And I said it's because I didn't have like culture or the religions where I'm from. Everyone's very predominantly white and speaks English. So I didn't really have that experience when I came to London. And also that where I live it's quite everyone's quite rich. So I wanted to come to London for their like like, like their experience of live of like, working with children that aren't as fortunate as I am and come from the same background as me. And also because I feel like London has it's like a vast culture and religion and yeah. it's very different to where I'm from. Got to know about the business employability office here, which mm -hmm. really assists the students in getting a placement here after mm -hmm. graduation. That was also the differentiating factor. I choose Greenwich over the other universities. And I feel like that's very important how media affects young children. Mm -hmm. As yeah. the media is growing and there's so much stuff for children to be seeing, I feel like it's very important yeah. that as teachers we're kind of aware of what's going on in our areas around us. It's yeah. important to have one topic that relates to the course you're applying to to talk about in the interview. It's really important. Yeah. Plus, I have a background in computer science, mm -hmm. which is bachelor's in computer science, so it's very easy for me to take a course in data science. So, yeah, it is a diversified school. It encourages people from different backgrounds, like from Asia and from Africa, and you know, that gives me a sort of confidence to, to, to come study here. They should not just stress out. That's it. Everything else would work fine. Yeah. Even if it, uh, things don't work according to their themselves or the way they want them to that's completely fine god has a better plan for them hey guys so i hope this video helped you so if it did please don't forget to subscribe share like and comment and please tell me in the comment section that what kind of videos do you want to see next because i try to read all of your comments and i try to answer it too so your comments really means to me a lot so try to comment that what kind of video do you want to see and i'll try to make regular video that's a promise thank you Thank you.